Hey there, ladies and gents. Um, it is Twiny here, y'all. I'm at the car wash. It is Saturday. It's 940 at the moment. You guys, I have literally been up since 6 o'clock this morning. I'm off today, thank goodness. And y'all, I was so productive. Got up, took my shower, washed my hair. Um, I was like, I have, I have got to make the most use of my daylight hours. I hope y'all can hear me because this car wash is loud. But I was like, I have to make the most use of these daylight hours. So I actually did a, um, a Walmart pickup for last night. But I did Walmart um, pickup. Well, I did Walmart pickup, but I did the order last night. And I had to pick it up early this morning. So I picked that up around 8.30. Um, took the, you know, the groceries home. I was like, um, I want to get as much done today as I possibly can. So, um, after I put all the groceries away, I fed Elijah. And, yeah, now I'm at the car wash. And I'm going to take a ride out, see what I can get into. So, yeah, I'll pick y'all back up. Y'all, my car is nice and clean. I'll probably clean the inside out later on today. I'm not going to clean it out at the car wash. I'll just clean it out later. Um, I'm going to show y'all my car. She nice and clean. Journey clean, y'all. She real clean. All right, y'all. My baby's clean. Yes, y'all. I have a mom. Um, little. It reminds you of like a crossover between like a minivan and an SUV. So, yes, my baby is clean. All right, y'all. Let me get going. Let's ride out to some stores. Of course, my husband and Elijah never want to go to any stores. So, yeah, I would talk and drive, but my, the little car mount I had bought from Ross like a while ago, it doesn't even fit on my rear view mirror. So, I don't know. I got to figure something out right now. I'm just holding a tripod, holding y'all up, but I'm going to have to put y'all down because I have nowhere to mount it. So, yeah, but, and today I have one. Well, I should show y'all my little fit. Y'all hear my little fit. Denim, jacket, jeans, some pink sneaks. I am so extra. These people probably like, what is she doing? But yeah, y'all, this is me. Let's go, y'all. Let's go. I'm so extra. All right, y'all. I made it to the, um, some stores. But I need some lip gloss on because my lips are so, they feel dry. They feel dry. Um, oh, and I forgot to tell y'all. Um, when I was at the car wash, I, I don't know if y'all care, but the car wash that I went to, um, it was like they had, you could get a car wash for $12, $13, or $14. The $14 wash is like the most expensive one. Um, I just did the $13 one, and I'm fine with that. Um, but there's another car wash like further up y'all i think their car wash is like 18 20 dollars it's something like that it might be more than that so i you know i was trying to get a car wash on a budget you know what i mean but yeah but um how much is y'all car washes where y'all live like is it expensive and y'all i'm about to put on some this is the bath and body works lip gloss one of my favorite i don't know if y'all can see that but these are normally eight dollars, but this is some good lip gloss. So let's put some on. Let's put some lip gloss on. And let's go look around the store. Um, see what we see. It's funny because I know a lot of times when y'all see me out and about, I'm like by myself. It's because for one, um, my daughters, they work, but also they don't like shopping. What young girl does not like shopping? And I mean, I'm not here to be buying a whole bunch of stuff, but I'm saying like, they do not like window shopping or nothing. They like to just like, if they need something, they like to just go what they go find what they need and boom, that's it. They do not like to shop. I'm like, how can y'all be my daughters and y'all don't like shopping? But me, I, I like, I do like to browse and see what's on clearance. Um, most of, I, I'll be honest with you, I only buy stuff that I feel that's affordable. Like, I'm not going to spend, I'm not, I, 
honestly, I don't want to buy a shirt if it's over $15. I don't want to buy a pair of jeans if they're over $20. Like, I want stuff that's very affordable. So, yeah. But, um, I'm just going to browse around. I think I'm going to go to Ross. I'm going to go to Marshall's, which is right down there. I don't know if I'll go in Old Navy because I never find nothing in Old Navy. And I feel like Old Navy's clothes are poor quality. That's just me. I, I know y'all might come for me in the comments if y'all like Old Navy. But I feel like Old Navy clothes are on the... They're a little pricey and then they're poor quality to me. So I don't really shop in Old Navy like that. Um... But I tell you who got the best quality like work clothes if you work in a professional setting. I'm going to tell y'all, Kato's has the best quality clothes I've ever bought. Now, some of their clothes are expensive, but I buy I buy their stuff, um, the clearance stuff. My head's itching. Her hair's itch, her scalp. But um, there, I have a pair of pants that I got from Kato's. I know I probably bought those pants probably 13 years ago. I swear to you. And they're like stretchy, y'all. Them pants still look good and they still fit because they're like stretchy pants. But Kato's have some very, very, very nice clothes that last a long time. But let me stop yapping and go in the store. It is 10.25. It feels so good to just get up, moving around early in the morning. I love it. But let's get in the store, y'all. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. yeah. I'm out of yeah. Turn up for the night. the night. Real thing, she's no average girl. Too fine, oh, she might. She's so yeah. damn fine. I just want to call on you. Call money on. just fall on you Not a thing I won't do Ooh yeah, yeah. I just wanna call on you hey. Let me do it all for you Let me do Can't it nobody fall on you for Ooh yeah. yeah She the girl in my visions Now that I found you I'm fiending for all your attention girl, Yeah I just want you Hope attention. you don't mind if I give you a tour of my mansion hey. Yeah, all of this for you, babe Nothing I won't do, babe Weak for your love Everywhere we go, it they be alright Yeah Can't help it with your body Just wanna make you happy I just wanna call on you Money just fall on you Not a thing I won't do Ooh, yeah. yeah I just wanna call on you let me do it all for you Can't nobody ball on you Ooh, yeah 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 Turn up for the night Real thing, she's no average Girl, too fine, oh, she might Give up on the baggage, girl you got too much going on in that mind, let me help you Yeah, yeah. Let me give you the moments in your life to step to Fly away together Can't help it with your body Just wanna make you happy I just wanna call on you Money just fall on you Alright y'all, so in this clip, I'm walking around um, Grocery Outlet Y'all, if you don't have a grocery outlet in your area, I'm telling y'all, they have, like, the best prices. Only thing, sometimes you do have to check the expiration date on items. But overall, you can get a pretty good deal in the grocery outlet. I love coming here. It's not, you know, real close to my house or anything. However, you know, I will take that drive and, you know, check out what they have. This lady was talking to me. She ended up saying something to me about the cookies or whatever. So I was talking to her. She was saying how her husband likes a lot of cookies, but she tries to stay away from them. Um, and those Milanos, they're like my favorite cookie, y'all. I love those. It's the extra dark chocolate ones, the double dark chocolate. They're so good. So I was 
talking to her. We were laughing because she said that her husband can eat like a whole box of Nutter Butters. These um, Fruity Pebble popcorns, um, I actually got those for Elijah. He said they were okay. He wasn't crazy about them, but I, they were like a dollar and some change. That's why I got them for him. Now I'm just, you know, scrolling through the store trying to figure out what else. I could possibly get checking out the prices um seasoning prices are pretty you know cheap as well but yeah you guys so but i'm gonna switch gears and talk about some other stuff y'all it has literally been like 14 days since i've actually posted a video i apologize y'all um however i sometimes get so um busy with work and just life in general and just having a lot to do I just, you know, have a hard time editing videos, recording, posting videos. I just get like in this slump. I hate to say it, you know, but I do get in a slump sometimes where I'm not in the mood to edit. I'm not in the mood to record. I'm not in the mood to post. So I apologize, y'all. Um, but yeah, it's just that's why I haven't posted in like, I think it's been like 12 days um, so I was like, you know what, my my supporters deserve a video. All right, y'all. Um, so I just left from out of grocery outlet. Um, I moved my car to this um, side of the parking lot because um, because of how the sunlight was beaming in, and I wanted to talk to y'all real quick. Um, I'm gonna show y'all what I grabbed out of Ross. I went inside of Ross. I went inside of um, Marshalls. I didn't get anything out of Marshalls. I didn't find anything. They had some cute little furniture pieces and stuff like that. But I did not get anything out of there. Um, I did get a little bit out of Grocery Outlet. Not much. Just a little bit. I only spent $14 in there. Y'all will see in the video. I bought like little snacks and stuff. And y'all, those Pepperidge Farm um, Double Dark Chocolate Cookies. Oh my gosh, y'all, they're so good. They had them on sale in Grocery Outlet for $1.99, so I bought two bags. Because normally, if you get them out of the store, they're like $3.99 or $4.50 for one bag. So, yeah. But, y'all, let me tell y'all what happened to me in Ross. So, you know, I'm going down the different aisles trying to see, you know, what I can find or whatever. And... I get down the aisle. It was like where the um, it was like the home goods stuff is or whatever. And I hear somebody say, "Oh, can you help me, please? Can you help me?" I was like, and I turn around and look like, cause I'm wondering, is this person talking to me? So when I turn around, like I turn around and look like that, like who is this? You know, I turn around and look, and. It's this tall, dark-skinned guy. I'll be honest. He was either African or Haitian. One or the other because you could hear, like, an accent. And, um... And I was like, help you with what? And I was very, like... My tone was different. It wasn't like... You know, I was like, help you with what? And, um... He was very abrupt or whatever. You know, and I... And he was like just come here come here i was like no i'm not coming here and i rolled my eyes and kept going down the aisle or whatever but i'm like what y'all ladies i'm telling you and your daughters when y'all are out be very careful people are doing some dumb stuff but i'm just like why what what made you think that i was gonna just come to you like you were summoning me or beckoning me to come to you. It's not going to happen. I'm going to tell y'all. 95% of the time, I'm cool, calm, and collective. But if your vibe is off with me, you will get a totally different Twanya. I'm, when I tell you a totally different Twanya, like you, you won't even recognize who I am. And that's me being real. Like, like if I feel threatened anyway or anything like that. Like, nah, I'll do what I have to do at all costs. That's all I'm going to say. But um, I always try to pay attention to my surroundings and stuff like that. Even when I'm sitting in the car, my doors are locked. 
I mean, I don't, I just don't play with people, especially like, you know, in the day and time we living in, and I'm not one of them type of people who tries to think, think negative, but I am very cautious, you know what I'm saying? I'm a very cautious person. Just like I see this dude walking around the parking lot with his little, look, I'm telling you, you just gotta be on your P's and Q's nowadays, because people are crazy. They are crazy as I don't know what, but I am getting hungry. It's 111. So I'm thinking about going to the Chinese buffet across the street. But I do want to go over to um I want to go to Five Below and I want to go to what is it called? It's some kind of shoe store over there. I want to go to that shoe store as well. So but I'm gonna show y'all really quickly what I got out of Ross. Um ooh. So I'm gonna show y'all real quick. I did get a new flat iron out of Ross. It's called Ola Bella flat iron. Goes up to 450 degrees. So I grabbed that. This was $19.99. So I grabbed this flat iron. I hope it works pretty good. I got it because I love a heavy flat iron. I feel like when they're real, real heavy, they work better. So yes, yeah, so I hope it works pretty good. But, yep, got a new flat iron. It's nice and heavy. Um, I also got some scent beads. They were only $4.99. You get two packs of the Clorox for Gonza scent beads. I grabbed those for our clothes. Um, Y'all saw me. Get, I got this black shirt for work. It's always good to have, like, a shirt like this so I can just wear it with a blazer. Um, cause sometimes, you know, I have to have a blazer on at work, depending on what's going on. But yeah, it's just a plain black shirt. I showed y'all though, in the store. Ooh, my face is in. Um, I got Elijah. I got him this champion shirt. It was only, this champion shirt was only $3.99. But this is what it looks like. I thought that was a nice little champion shirt. He can just, you know, wear it when it starts getting a little warmer. Um, y'all, they had these gloves on on clearance. <laughs> these gloves were ninety nine cent. Ninety nine cent. You get two pair. You get a white and a black pair. So I'm like, hey, fifty cent per glove. You know, per pair. Um, I also grabs. I got two packs of these. I love wearing these. Um, socks. The no show. Um, socks. These, you get three pair, brown, tan, and black. They were $2.99 a piece. If you wear like ballerina shoes or flat shoes, having these socks are really, really good. So I grabbed two packs of those. Um, I also grabbed some of this facial toner. I'm running out of toner at home that I got out of um, Burlington a while ago. I think maybe, I don't know, it might've been a month or two ago, but I bought some of this toner. I hope I hope it works pretty good, but yeah, toner. And y'all, I bought this before. I love body butter better than lotion, so I did get this coconut milk um, body cream. I guess I shouldn't have called it body butter. It's a body cream, but it's nice and thick. It's nice and thick, which I love. I love a thick cream or a thick lotion. It smells so good. Mm, I love this stuff. They had they had three of them in there but i didn't want to be greedy they l and these are 5.99 5.99 and the toner was the toner was 3.99 so yeah but yeah that's what i got out of um Ross. oh wait i forgot y'all i got these too these cute earrings i'm always buying earrings these earrings um, how much were they? These were $5.99. So I grabbed these cute little earrings. I better wrap them in these gloves before they get messed up. But yeah, y'all, that's everything I got out of Ross. I spent, I think it was like $60 is what I spent. But I'm going to go ahead and go in five below. And I don't know, I don't know y'all if I'm going to pick y'all back up because... I already feel like this video is going to be very, very, very long. So, I don't know. But, 
Yeah, so let me go to Five Below and then get me something to eat. Oh, and also go to that shoe store. I kind of want, I feel like, I feel like calling my husband and asking him, does he want to meet me to the Chinese buffet? But I don't know. We'll see. I wonder what he'll say. All right, y'all. I'll be back. Maybe, I guess. I'll see. All right.